This is the 34th video of the Wargaming of Wargame Wargames Design Studios Waterloo campaign. This is the second series and in this series I am playing the British and the Prussians and the game's artificial intelligence is playing the French. It is June 16, 1815, 8.45 a.m. Uh, and it's turn 72 out of 388 turns. And it's the Allies' movement phase. Now, later on this day, I believe at about 1 o'clock, Marshal Ney begins the Battle of Croix de Bras, and like 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon, Napoleon begins the Battle of Ligne, or Ligne as I like to say it, but I guess it's pronounced Ligne. So, let us see where we left off. These guys aren't moved yet, so we probably go to the head of the line here. Yes, these guys are not... Okay, I see the gap here, so that's where we haven't moved. Uh, let's see if these guys have moved. Yes, these guys have moved. And we'll send this cavalry down here. All right. Now we are advancing down a battlefield of our choice to see if we can tempt the cowardly French into battle. If not, then we will seek them out in their lair.
Oh, shoot. Okay. Get things under control here. Hmm. I gotta check all those scouts now. Okay. I guess we get the pinkies in line here.
go. Didn't like going that way. Where the heck is he going? North. Okay. Oop. Oh. Okay.
looks like I moved these guys. Oh, not all of them. Well, that guy's staying there. This guy's staying there. This guy's in a good position. This guy's going to creep in the town and see what's what. Alright. This guy's charging. Now, I got all these guys up here. Let's see. Some further up here. Ah, Calvary, huh? All right, let's do a close up here. Check everything's all done. Let's check out if we get anybody new. Nope. And let's go down to our potential battlefield. Oop. See how things are going to shape up here. All right, that looks like a good view. French defensive fire. Ooh, 15 men on my cavalry. That's not nice. Taking some long-range shots. Allied offensive fire. Don't believe I have any. Allied melee. That I do. Let's see. I guess I got my pick. Charge these guys. They're on clear. I can charge these guys. Oh, I think I'll go for these guys. Whoa! I got eight, he got 84. I can continue. Oh, this is just wonderful when you can continue. So I can hit these guys again. Oh, I got one. He got 89 and he disappeared. Two skirmishers gone. Well, that's nice. 
Okay. That, I believe, is that. French movement. Boy, he's got a lot of skirmishers out there. He's got to have the parent infantry battalions within three hexes for them to move. So there's a lot of people hidden in woods nearby, like those woods right there. I had to cancel my graphics pen. See, I could have used it now. But uh, it just started freezing up every time. So then, when I called them to cancel, of course they have robotics answering the phone. But uh, they wanted $5 to answer my question. <laughs> so I just said I want to cancel. 50 times and that was it and then they finally canceled me Jesus that's how it is with the software companies now robotics answering your phone and then if you want to have a human and I, I suspect that isn't true you're going to get another robot but it's a higher level robot and it wants $5 and I noticed the, hu the robots are always named with human names, like Irish names or English names, it's never a diversity name. You know, and it's always got a, a, a white person, either a woman or a guy, picture associated with the robot. And you're supposed to think you're, you're uh, talking to a human, you know, and it's one that looks like they actually know something. Uh, but you're not. You're talking to a robot. And then the robot asks, your que asks you a question about what do you want, and then it turns you over to another robot. <laughs> That's what you pay for when you get software. I don't, I don't know if I'm ever going to order any more software. As soon as there's some issue or problem, you're dead. Because it's all robots you're talking to, pre-programmed robots. And if they hear a certain word, they transfer you. They transfer you to another robot because it's uh, 
it's all set up that way, the robot. And then they said they're expert specialists. Jesus. Make me shit. They're not specialists. They're robots. So that's the way it is now. This this company here that developed this game, they still have humans answering the phone. In fact, I when I answered the phone I was, with a question, I was surprised. I was talking with one of the developers of the game, which amazed me. Uh, now he's desperately trying to swing right here, I suppose, cross the, cross the bridge and take position against me. Which is going to be interesting because I'm going to file into this position. But that's not where we're necessarily going to have the battle because I may move the British Army to the right and then cross the bridges and then swing the Prussians to the right so I'm on the same side of the Sambra as the French. It looks like all the French are south of the Sambra. What cowards! They were just cowering there waiting for me to cross. And... They should have, the game should have been called right there because Napoleon lost. He, he should have just abdicated. His only hope was to attack one of the Allied armies in Belgium, either the French or the, the Prussians or the British and uh, overwhelm one and then attack the other and then go east against the Russians and Austrians. So the Russians and Austrians keep, are continuing to march towards France while Napoleon's at a stalemate here. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, I don't think I'm going to have any fire. So I know the Frenchies will have some because they've moved right next to my cavalry. Okay. French melee. Nope. Oh, it's our movement again. Okay. Oh, I think I'm going to swing around this direction. This guy's in a chateau, so he's good. Ah, uh, what do I want to do here? Guy, I'm gonna swing through here. Uh, looks like we've got no one over here, but we're gonna go down this road to check it out. He's going to come down here. I want to see if these guys are still over here. Yep, someone is. We'll go a little further down to see if anybody's down there. Now, this guy... Whoa! It's going to take a trip into town. Well, we do have people in towns. 
in uh, Cherlois. I guess I can turn on uh, map labels so we see where we are. Okay, that's what I thought. He's probably got a shitload of people in Cherlois. Okay, these guys are positioned good. This Calvary, there's no point for him to be there. I'll send him up here. This Calvary guy, I gotta get out of there. Now this guy, where is he gonna go? Uh, he could go back up the way he came. These guys have no zones of control, which I think is what he's going to do. He's disordered. Put this guy up here and let's turn him so he can charge. Oh, he's disordered. Well, we'll put this guy up here and turn him. Just in case somebody wants to come up there after him. And I'll turn this guy. Let's see if this guy... Ooh, look at this. Skirmish, skirmisher and... A column and two leaders. Just waiting for me. All right, let's check out the uh, elevations here. Okay, we got high ground here. My purpose isn't so much to come down here as it is to hold these guys' attention so that my army can deploy on the right. So, start setting these big boys down here. See what he thinks about all of this. Next turn, they'll start deploying, I think. <laughs> he may think this is the vanguard of the army, which is what we want him to think. To occupy his attention so he doesn't start shifting right prematurely okay those guys are set now these guys are gonna start dropping down here at least some of them What we got here? Line unit, huh? Well, I think we'll threaten some charges. We'll see if he goes in a column. Or a square, not column. some artillery set up here. Unlimber.
fearless leader. I guess we'll put him up there. Oh, shit. God damn it. That's what I get for not having any signs. Now I just ordered that bastard. Where the hell's his officer? Way over here. God damn it. Okay. And he's got no movement left. Or does he? No, he does have some. He'll have to come up there and rally the bastard. Shit, uh, I gotta take these names down. I always start guessing and then I hit the wrong hex. God damn it. I think I'm going to go down here. There's my captured supply. How handy. Okay, that's good. How can this skirmish be low on ammo? He hasn't had any fighting. Strange things about this game. Okay, these guys will stay here. Now, here come the troops. Now, I better attend to my other skirmishers here. This guy's coming out of the woods. Crossroads. Okay, let's take down map elevations so I can see where my skirmishers are out here. Oh, is there anybody on this road, I wonder? Peekaboo. Nope. So these are just some scouts. I don't care about them. Oh, there's two of them there. I'll keep tabs on them. If they want to charge me, that's fine. They'll disorder. Let's go down this road. I think those are my outliers. So I got one here coming. And another one here. It's always good to have backups. You see if anyone's creeping around in back of you. Do I 
this road covered? No, I don't. We should. This guy will have to go backwards and cover it. Okay. All right. Russians.
Okay. Now oh, the British cavalry can go down here. Their cavalry. All right. Well, it's time for these guys to come down. These guys are pinkies. Probably should have sent them down here.
Poor Wellington. It's got a... Oh, Christ. Look at it. M missed that road junction. That was a glitch in the program. Should have followed this road junction. Huh. Yeah, I slipped the gear. You can't always count on AI. Okay, now all we got is this riffraff here. Okay, do I get anybody else? No. All right, let's go on to the next phase. French defensive fire. Allied offensive, and we're going to stop there because it's 60 minutes. We'll continue on next time.